Hello, a very warm good evening to you out there and welcome to singing our own songs. On the program today, we have one of the legendary Zambian musicians who will be talking to us about his music and giving us advice about how, what he thinks about music uh, in Zambia at the moment. And this is no other than the legendary Larry Maluma. Mr. Maluma, welcome to the program. Thanks very much. My pleasure. It's so good to have you on the show, and I'm, I'm, I'm sure a lot of people out there are actually surprised. They can't believe that uh, what they're seeing right now, because you've been gone, and like we don't know where you are at the moment. So <laughs> I'm hiding down under, somewhere down under. <laughs> okay, great. So for, just you know, for, for those people that may, might not know, who is Larry? Larry. Maluma. Well, Larry Maluma was um, born in Zambia. Okay. He went to school in Zambia and uh, started playing music in Zambia. Okay. Then went to Australia, and that's where he's been living for a while. And um, here I am now, still playing music. Mm -hmm. Yes. So Larry is a musician. Z one of the great Zambian musicians, and I remember one of your songs, Punzi Sani Ana, Yo Yo Yo. That's correct. Ziku, Nila Tuta was, yeah, that was one of the really, uh, one of my favorite songs at that time because I was I was a kid. Right. So right. I, I felt yeah. good that someone was speaking on behalf of kids. Actually. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. So um, we'd just like to know about you know your music. Um, why did you go to us to play music in Australia instead of staying in Zambia? Well, you know, those days um, um, we couldn't make, um, no one made money out of music, you know, those days. Um, mm. um, we never used to get royalties from radio stations or television stations. Um, there, was, um, I mean, there was only one television station by then. Um, yeah, so, so everyone was um, trying to find green pastures, you know, mm. and um, I thought, um, you know, Australia would be a good place to go because um, um, after doing a bit of research, I, I heard that there wasn't a lot of, um, you know, uh, African reggae or world music in Australia. So I thought, um, you know, I head um, down under. Mm. And um, yeah, uh, so I did. Okay. Yeah. So you have been a musician that has been really true to your music because other people, if they don't get money from music, they'll do another job, you know, or something. But you've really had the passion. You wanted to do music. So yes, I love, I love my music, and uh, so that's how I make a living, you know, as well, wow. <laughs> which is um, f fortunate enough, you know. Okay. So, you know, there's the, this big talk about brain drain. Could you describe yourself as one of the people with lost through that process. Uh, what do you mean exactly? Brain drain? Is <laughs> well, it's some, some, some kind of thing that we talk about that, you know, a lot of experts, professionals leave this country to go outside for yeah. greener pastures. Right, right. You know? Yeah. And we, we never thought of it in terms of music, for example, that musicians also might leave the country to go outside. Yeah, but if I am... Um, I still play Zambian music. I still sing in Zambian. I still send my music here, and um, you know, you, I, I, if you want to live off music, you've got to you know, you've got to do something about it. You can't just sit around and uh, wait for what. I mean, no one's gonna feed you if you don't do it yourself. So that's what I was basically doing by going to Australia, you know. And um, but I still play. I still sing in Zambian, you know, in, in Zambian languages. I still um, play Zambian music. Mm. You know, I get the Australian guys to learn my music, which mm. is, um, you know, um, reggae, African, Zambian, you know? Mm. And um, so I don't think, um, I don't think I'm, what they call it, brain drain. <laughs> 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 okay. Right. okay, great, that's great. Because whatever you do, you send it back home. Definitely. So it's for the good of home. Definitely. I'm, I'm really I would like to introduce my music on a larger scale, you know. I would like to, you know, get it across 
yeah, so many different um, countries. You know. That's that's amazing. You know, that's that's amazing. You know that you, you move somewhere to to enhance what you have and give it back home. That's 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 genius. I think it's amazing. Now you know you have got uh, a new album, uh, Mark and Angu, your latest album. Yes. And on this album, there's a track, Warrior. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and I, I love the track. And uh, I would, would you allow me right now to share it with the viewers out there who would want to see it? Most welcome. I hope everybody enjoys this one. It's all for you because we are all warriors. Enjoy everyone this one. Everyone is a warrior. <laughs> <laughs> 